another attack ad by Senator Baldwin taking a clip of me being interviewed, and of course they don't put the whole context to the matter, of saying, of course we're going to need to make some changes to Social Security. What I talked about at that point in time is that Social Security, when it was enacted, the retirement age was 65, life expectancy was 62. Today, Social Security retirement age is 65. You can actually start pulling it from it at 62 today if you want. And life expectancy is basically 80s for males, 81 for females. But here's the big thing. If you look at what's going on with biotechnology, the reality of it is younger people very well, people that are 40 and younger, may end up living to 100, 110 years old. Uh, there is such promising things on the biotechnology uh, front. I, I follow a lot of the stuff because I fund medical research for MS and I follow the things that are advancing. So we know we have to make adjustments. So when I was talking in the interview uh, 13 and a half or 14 years ago, I was talking about the adjustments in age would start at for people 40 and younger and making those adjustments then. People that had a long time to adjust for. Instead, we've got an ad saying, I want to take older people's Social Security away. Of course, I don't want to take social, older people's Social Security away. So you would favor a lower age, uh, I mean, a higher age for people who are under 30 or 40? Yes, because the reality of it is life expectancy is going to increase significantly. And here's the other thing we also know. If you look at how uh, people that live longer and better, they tend to stay engaged in the workforce or in, in civic activities uh, for a longer period of time. 